the little red dot. The, on. the little red dot is on because mm-hmm. that indicates that yeah that it's on. I kind of turned the viewfinder. I'm kind of techy. You really are for for you. Um, all right, so. Just so you guys know, my dad and my mom are in town this week, uh, and they've been visiting. And I wanted both of them to watch the new Ghostbusters trailer. That's you know for the movie that's coming out this summer. And my dad, he grew up during that time. Where were you like? Forty. I never grew up. Yeah, well, that's obviously true. Um, <laughs> so I wanted them to see the new trailer for it, and just to give you know their opinion. And my mom doesn't want to be on camera, but my dad, of course. Loves being on camera, correct? There you go. So I'm going to show him the this is the first trailer that was ever put out for Ghostbusters, and I just wanted to get his reaction to it, and we're going to watch that right now. Okay, you ready? All right. We I call get... this presbyopia. Is that like French for old person? No, it, sort of. <laughs> it, it's actually Latin for old eyes. Ah, there you go. Okay, go ahead. All right. All right, so we're going to hit play now. Okay, so now that we've actually found the correct trailer, because the first one that I found was not the correct one, we're actually going to watch. This is the first trailer that I believe that came out, and we're going to do it. Ready? Three, two, one, beep. So there's hope. I thought you know. Are you serious? Are you really serious? Yeah, you know, I, they, the, for the most part, when you try to, to sequel uh, an icon, it ends up stinking. Uh, and this, you know, it's, it is not the same. It is not the same. Right. But, you know. Well, did you did you catch the references? Okay, well, like okay, like in the first part where the, where, well, where especially where, the, the the one ghost uh, he was. The one ghost. Yeah, one? The, the round one. Slimer? Yes. He was in there. Yeah, he was in there for like two seconds. Yeah. But did you catch the beginning part? Like how that was an homage to when they were in the library and they tried to talk. Homage. To... Homage. Isn't that French for cheese? It's it's fromage. I'm Never not I, I didn't study French. Never mind. Never mind. Oh my god. Anyway. But the first part where remember where they were in the uh, uh, library? Mm-hmm. And remember where they the guys they saw the, the ghost? And then they were like, oh, they, you know, one of them tries to go up and talk to it and it screams at him. That's what it was homaging 
from one of them. Now, a lot of people hate this. Why do you think people don't like this? Because of the Lone Ranger. I didn't think about that. That's actually... They, there they took the, the, one of the greatest icons of American uh, cinema history and they uh, had a court injunction to not let him wear his mask when he did appearances, Clayton Moore. So he ended up getting a really big set of sunglasses to sort of look like the mask. And so anyhow, so the, uh, whatever the film company was, cut him off. And then they had, what's his idiot, his tanto. Um, Johnny Depp? Yeah. What? You don't like Johnny Depp? Why do, what the... What the hell is wrong with Johnny Depp? Did you see Black Mass? No. He was great in that one. Is he one. a priest? That has nothing to do with being a priest. Unless priests beat and torture and shoot people. Well. Back in Chicago, probably. The, the point is, you know, they took they took something and really camped it up to bits, you know? Right, and, right. Well, what'd you, and, and this being somewhat camped to start with. 30 years long ago. Where right. Did you, little well, well, people were mad about, like, okay, like, uh, the one, I, I don't know her name, but the black lady who's literally, like, two feet taller than everybody else. People are mad. They're saying, like, oh, they're just, they're throwing in the token black woman. Yeah, I mean, that's obvious. They already threw in the token women. Right. Don't troll us. Careful. This is YouTube. <laughs> no, the, no, people hate that. <laughs> no. They, uh, obviously, you know, they, they can't just rubber stamp it and make it the same. Uh, and uh, everything uh, also depends on the milieu in which it's uh, shown. 30 years ago, uh, you know, people were at a different stage of, of, of the culture. Right, so right. So a lot well, of people... things that they did, like references to the Stay Puff Man. Right. You know, now, you have to turn who knows, towards the camera. Who knows about Thanks. Stay Puff anymore? Right. No, that's true. And and the thing is, is that my question is a lot in a lot of this. It's like this said 30 years ago, like even when this started out, the whole trailer started out like it had that really eerie vibe. Like, I don't remember the old trailers. We call it music. Well, no, but they were making it seem like this is going to be a really serious movie. And obviously, you know, well, yeah, it has Melissa McCarthy in it. But, you know, it's like how serious yeah, can that really no, be? No, no. I mean, but the thing is, is that you can't replace the old Ghostbusters. You can't do that. I mean, no, you, you, no, no, you just, you right, just can't. But you know they are supposed to make an appearance. They are actually on the on, on the Internet Movie Database list to possibly make an appearance in the movie. Yeah, well, you know the, the, that's a, again sort of a, a tradition. Let people do cameo of, of what they used to be. Right. Rebecca and never did. Rebecca De Mornay. Rebecca, Rebecca, Rebecca to that again. <laughs> we have some links down below if you want to see that. <laughs> anyway, so in, in general, do you think that this? They, are, do you think it's good that they're trying to do this? Like, you're like. Well, I think it's interesting. I mean, it, 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 we'll wait and see what it looks like. I mean, the the proof is in the in the film. No, and and it is, and like I like Kristen Wiig. I like a lot of those other actresses. But the the one thing that I'm trying to wonder is is like, if the if they already made the technology 30 years ago to trap the ghosts. Why do they have to make it again? It's sort of like, you know... Wait, 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 wait. There is your basic problem. And, okay. You're trying to make sense out of nonsense. Do you realize Batman and Superman just came out and everybody's trying to make sense out of that? Hey, they should get a life. Right. Get a life. You can uh, super analyze any of the, especially anything that's sort of science fiction based or whatever. Uh, you know, the, but the point is they made it up to start with and so they can make up anything they want. No, that's true. And it's, it's like, you can't, you can, you can make another story. You can make another sequel of anything and it, it can just be shit. It can be just you know, completely garbage. Like the Lone Ranger was garbage, Com was, was completely garbage. Did you actually see it? Yes. What? Mom saw it. If you compare what they did with the Lone Ranger versus it had what they did. nothing whatsoever to do with the Lone Ranger except for the name. Really? Yes. Have you ever seen any of the Lone Ranger serials? I've only seen none of them. Who was that masked man? Oh. I don't know, but he left this silver bullet. You know, that mm. sort of thing. That's pretty accurate. You gotta be, you know, I mean, it was black and white. It was very, uh, right. well, very the, straightforward, done on a very small stage. Right. Also, you know, think about the Green Hornet. Remember that one that came out with Seth Rogen? Mm-hmm. You know, like, that was, that was practically garbage because yeah. I, I saw you I actually did see a couple of those old episodes but in general they're trying to get out this new feel they're trying to like bring you know like to, now everybody was mad that they made they put women in it and the thing is, well, is do mean, you that, think 
Like, I don't think that that's a bad thing. No, it's not a problem. I mean, if they put actors in it, who cares? Uh, but the what really gets me is some of the smarmy, self-indulgent, self... Indulgent, self uh, the hipster stuff? Yeah, I mean, <laughs> uh, catch this, you know, ha ha ha, I'm so cool. Yeah, come on, just act. Yeah, yeah, like I mean, over overacting the role. Yeah, and, yeah, well, no, I get that. I'm trying to, I can't find the right phrase. I mean, like a little kid who says something dirty. <laughs> you know? Right, right. Uh, well, do you, okay, do you know who directed, you know who directed this, right? Not at all. Okay, uh, is uh, Paul Feig, and Paul Fe Fe eh, Feig, Paul Feig, he directed Bridesmaids. And what? so, Bridesmaids? That was a movie? Yeah. Oh, okay. Really big for Kristen Wiig, Melissa McCartney, a lot Who's of she? Kristen Wiig? Yeah. SNL? Oh, you mean lately? Lately, yes. Yeah. I'm glad we have a professional opinion on this. The reason that I kind of like and don't like this is that I enjoyed the other two Ghostbusters movies so much because it had, it wasn't just a, it wasn't just a comedy, but it was a story. It was about how these four guys came together and they were middle-aged and they were just it wasn't much actually like did you see in the last part of the trailer like they had like the guns like it was like um it was like melee like she punched a ghost like like literally with brat with knuckles and punched the ghost and killed it so it's like it's no longer fighting the ghost with the with the streams it's like now it's all melee and but like otherwise like i don't want them to try to be the same if it's going to be its own thing it's going to be its own thing you know just don't expect to put women in it and then expect everybody to love it. They need to try to make it its own thing with this cast. And then that's kind of where I see it. Um, yeah, this is going to need to be edited. This is going on way too long. It really is. Um, anyway, uh, the, the whole point, it, it, and, and you're, you're quite right. Uh, you don't make a movie uh, to satisfy the, the uh, scoreboard and check all the boxes. We have one Eskimo, we have one woman, we have one, you know, whatever. Right. Nonsense. You make a movie that's a movie that's a good movie. Right. And who, who's in it, you know, doesn't matter. You don't have to keep score. You just have to make a good movie. Right. So in general, I think, you know, like, they did. They, they're, they're going to try to do it. I think, honestly, this has a high failure rate. Like, there's, there's a, a, a Egypt Gods and Monsters or whatever that movie came out. I can't, I, it, was, mm -hmm. it was so no. dumb. That looked like it was CGI. This, this, this too looks like CGI Spectacular, but... Like, you can almost smell failure if it's done wrong. So, in, in general, I thought it was pretty good. I, th I think that it has a strong ability to be good or bad, and you think, in general, what's your, of your rating... I, I'm waiting to see it. I, I, I think it might be interesting. Might be interesting? Yeah. Okay. Have you ever uh, really seen uh, SCTV? We're Second really, City... Uh, we're going so. on too long. If you go back, uh, SCTV, John right. Candy, all those guys, they started with SCTV up in Toronto. Right. And uh, they used to do a bit with redneck uh, movie reviewers. And they usually would end up, and it blowed up. It blowed up real it blowed good. Blowed up real good. It blowed up real good. <laughs> yeah, so a lot of the movies now seem to do a lot of, a lot of uh, blow up real good. And there's no movie. It's just a lot of uh, computerized effects. I see. And that bird in the back, Mary? Yeah. Those, <laughs> those are chickens. Those are chickens in the background. Yeah. Uh, people are wondering where we're at. But you know what? I think we don't tell them. We, we can't. No. 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 It's a no, secret. No. It's a secret. So, yeah. Anyway, thank you guys for watching our review of the new Ghostbusters trailer. My name I, is Victor with a K, and this is. Alex first. with a with a K? It's perfect. Thank you. See ya.